Wow, viewers, my name is Francis. Um, this minute, uh, you and I need more information about livestock keeping, especially rabbit production. In order to make things simple so that we can grow faster and then drive in the business. So, um, there are so many ways you can get information. You can gain skills to improve on your, your farm, okay? But before that, when you are new here, consider subscribing so that we can grow together. Give a thumb up if you like the video and don't forget to share it with your friends uh, out there. Yes, um, number one, I will encourage you to read more books 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 read more books concerning livestock keeping especially rabbit production yes um you can visit any bookshop around your area you buy some books uh, based on agri then you go and read them at your your leisure time yes or you can visit uh, public libraries where you can get books to read for free. Some of these books, you can even borrow them from friends around your area, agri students, agri officers, and then other livestock keeping farmers. Yes, you can get books from them to read for more experience, gaining knowledge, gaining, in, in, improving on your skills. Yes, that's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. And then number two, number two, the second way I think you can gain more information or skills on your rabbit production is to visit a rabbit farmer near your area. It's as simple as that. Um, when you visit a colleague rabbit farmer, you are going to get first-hand experience on most of the things that you need to do on your farm. But I will encourage you that when you pay a visit to a farmer, do these things. Now, number one, take a closer look at how the cages are being constructed. The feeders, the drinkers, and then the, the kind of watering system that particular farmer is using, okay? When you are able to do this, it's going to help you a lot. Before you leave that farmer's uh, place, you are carrying a lot of experience um, to go and then apply on your farm. So that's it for you. And then the third way by which you can gain more information to apply on your farm. Now we are, we are in the information world. It's online. Visit online. Google to save PDFs of um, uh, books for free and read them at your leisure time. Yes. And then better still, YouTube. YouTube is there. So congrats because you are at the right place at the, uh, right now. So on YouTube, watch as many videos as you can concerning livestock keeping, especially rabbit production. Exclusive videos on rabbit production. Now, um, YouTube is considered to be the fastest and practical source of information as at now. Yes, and I hope you will bear with me. Yes, so uh, on the YouTube, as you are watching, leave your comments. When the video has been able to assist you, leave a comment, ask questions, and then the producer will get back to you, answer your questions. Um, probably you can even get the uh, uh, WhatsApp lines and the other channels to choose the one that will be easier for you. You try to connect with the person, ask questions, and seek for assistance, and you are good to go. So, viewers, in a summary, um, we need to get more information for our business to thrive. So in that way, 
we need to read more books um we need to cooperate with other rabbit farmers and then we don't also have to uh, forget or relent in going online doing more research about our field so i hope you've learned something and you're going to apply it right away on your farm thank you for watching see you very soon